Hey guys, I'm myself here, and today I wanted to talk about the iPod Shuffle, the iPod Nano, and the iPod Touch. Apple has officially discontinued the iPod Shuffle and the iPod Nano. They will no longer be for sale on Apple's online store. So of course I wanted to go pick one up uh, of each just to make sure that I have them on my collection. Now the only ones that are discontinued are going to be the Shuffle and the Nano. The iPod Touch received a minor update, not internally, but Apple is now lowered the price. 32 gigabytes go for $199 and the 128 for $299. The 16 gigabyte and the 64 gigabyte models have been completely discontinued from Apple's online store. And once the inventory runs out, wherever the iPods are sold, I believe the Shuffle and the Nano will no longer be for sale. Apple is no longer going to be making them. I've never really been a big fan of the iPod Shuffle, but I know a lot of people like them and some of you guys ask about them. The iPod and Nano has gone through so many changes throughout the year and uh, this one was the most drastic honestly because the icons didn't even match what Apple normally goes for. It had rounder icons instead of square like you see on the iPhones and things like that. So it was a completely different device at least the final or the last generation even the home button had that circle right there in the center which was kind of weird to me it was just a different device it was almost like they didn't know what else to do with this thing and i really enjoyed it but of course the ipod touch and the iphone sort of cannibalized sales for these two devices so i did grab these two just to have them on my collection so that i keep them and have those there now this ipod touch of course as i mentioned uh, now comes in the uh, 32 gigabyte and the 128 so i picked one of these up because apple of course is offering a better price and i wanted to see if i got lucky and got a software that i can jailbreak honestly that was the reason why i got it so let's go ahead and look here and power it up and uh see what software it's running i love the color it even looks better than the black iphone if you ask me let me go bring the black iphone here i don't know what do you think black or this gray which one looks best to you i kind of like the gray better i don't know why but the black is awesome as well on the iphone so let's go ahead and boot this up let me set it up and see what software is running all right so i'm done setting it up let's go ahead and take a look inside let's see the software that's running Hopefully, I can jailbreak this thing. General and the moment of truth about. Oh, man. 10.2.1. Missed it by one digit. Darn it. Anyway, the iPod Touch is an amazing device. I'm going to keep this one around. And I just wanted to inform you guys. You know, the iPod Touch hasn't received an update since July of 2015. So, I believe this one's on its way out as well. Unfortunately, I always felt like this product was the in-between. Something I can get, uh, let's say, like my nephews or my nieces. Uh, where it's sort of like an iPhone, but without the phone. And it was, you know, a very cool device to own. I remember my first device actually was an iPod. It was an iPod Touch. Let me know what device was your first Apple uh, iOS device if you ever owned one and uh, just informing you guys with this video hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you think in the comments down below do you think Apple did the right thing by discontinuing the shuffle the nano and probably in the future the iPod touch let me know what you think in the comments down below hope you guys enjoy the video and I'll see you real soon peace